the High Court has temporarily suspended the new university funding model following a petition filed by the Human Rights Commission and the Elimubora Working Group and students. The parties argued that the model is unjust and limits educational opportunities. And as Diana Nashpai explains in the following report, the High Court Judge Justice Chacha Mwite noted that the case has been long overdue, citing delays. President William Ruto's administration faced a significant setback when the High Court of Kenya on October 3, 2024, temporarily suspended the implementation of the new university funding model. The ruling follows a case filed by the Kenyan Human Rights Commission arguing the model is discriminatory and denies access to higher education for thousands. The lawsuit initiated on October 13, 2023 by the Kenyan Human Rights Commission, the Elimubora Working Group, Boaz Waruk and the Students Kakus contends that the new model unjustly limits educational opportunities for many students. Justice Chacha Mwita, who delivered the ruling, expressed concerns over delays by the Attorney General, the Education Cabinet Secretary, and the Kenya University and colleagues' Central Placement Service in submitting their response to the case. Funding model in question categorizes students into five brands according to their financial needs using a means testing instrument. This tool evaluates a student's required financial assistance based on various factors including family background and income. Despite the government's intent to improve educational access through this model, critics argue that it complicates rather than solves the challenges in higher education. Many have suggested that improving the previous funding system would have been a more practical solution. The case will resume for further hearing on December 16, 2024, when parties will present their submissions deciding the fate of the contentious funding plan. Diana Nashipai, KUTV.